Hey, what's going on YouTube? My name is King White and welcome to my 120 fire making guide. Now before we get into the video itself, I want to encourage you to hit that like and subscribe button if you do enjoy the video. Also, I stream daily on Twitch now, so if you're interested in watching me live, the link will be in the description. Beginning with a list of useful items while fire making, the portable brazier comes in at the number one slot. While using the portable brazier, it gives a 10% boost to your base XP along with a 10% chance of saving a log. You can find 24-7 portable braziers in the portables FC. Coming in next at the number 2 slot is the crystal tinderbox in its augmented version. The crystal tinderbox grants a 5 times chance to obtain fire spirits along with the ability to add gizmos and gain invention XP. The last item worth mentioning on this list is the flame gloves. While wearing flame gloves, your base fire making XP will be boosted by 2% and when worn with the ring of fire, this boost will become 5%. Now that we've got the useful items out of the way, let's move into the actual methods. From levels 1 to 15, normal logs will be the best option as it is inexpensive and easily achievable. Each log will grant 50 XP for a total of 49 logs you will need. This will cost 18,669 GP at a price of 7.62 GP per XP. From levels 15 to 30, you'll be using oak logs. Oak logs grant 85 XP per log and you will need a grand total of 129 logs to reach level 30. At 1.51 GP per XP, this will cost a total of 16,512 GP and will take an average time of 12 minutes to complete. From levels 30 to 45, you'll be using Willow Logs. Willow Logs grant 105 XP per log and you will need a total of 586 logs to reach level 45. At 1.16 GP per XP, this will cost a grand total of 71,492 GP and will take an average time of 50 minutes to complete. From levels 45 to 60, you'll be using Maple Logs. Maple logs grant 165 XP per log and you will need a total of 1,659 logs to reach level 60. At 0.57 GP per XP this will cost a grand total of 155,946 GP and will take an average time of 2 hours and 25 minutes to complete. From level 60 to 75 you'll be using U logs. U logs grant 260 XP per log and you will need a total of 4,656 logs to reach level 75. At 0.70 GP per XP, this will cost a grand total of 847,392 GP and will take an average time of 6 hours and 45 minutes to complete. From level 75 to 90, you'll be using Magic Logs. Magic Logs grant 309.5 XP per log and you will need a total of 17,274 logs to reach level 90. At 1.32 GP per XP, this will cost a grand total of 7,065,066 GP and will take an average time of 24 hours and 35 minutes to complete. Once you reach level 90, there are two options that you can take to go about getting level 99. In the first option, you will be using magic logs all the way to 99. At 309.5 XP per log, you will need 42,115 logs, costing a total of 17,225,035 GP and taking around 59 hours to complete. In option 2, you will be using Elder Logs to reach level 99. Elder Logs grant 449 XP per log at a rate of 13.68 GP per XP. You will need 29,030 logs to reach level 99, costing a grand total of 178,331,290 GP. This method is quite pricey, so I highly recommend using option 1 if you can't afford option 2. From levels 99 to 120, there are two viable options. However, option 2 is extremely pricey in my opinion and completely not worth the GP. In option 1, you will be using magic logs all the way to 120. You will need 336,909 magic logs, costing a grand total of 137 million. 795,781 GP and taking an average time of 468 hours to complete. Option 2 consists of using Elder Logs all the way to 120. At 449 experience per log, you will need a total of 232,235 logs, costing 1,426,619,605 GP averaging a time of 324 hours to complete. Alright guys, that's going to complete my 120 fire making guide. I hope I could provide some useful tips and tricks to help you get your 120 cape. Please give the video a big thumbs up if I did provide you with a pleasant experience. And as always, comment and subscribe. See you in the next one. Peace.